Hi and welcome to Re3D. My name is Matthew Fiedler. I'm co-founder and CTO for Re3D. And I'm super excited to introduce you to the newest in our line of large format industrial 3D printers. The Terabot here was designed and built from the ground up by our in-house additive manufacturing experts and boasts a 36 by 36 by 40 inch build volume and a whole host of features that make it a solid choice for your next large format industrial fused filament fabrication 3D printer. Scaling up our GB3 Plus was really prompted by our customers' needs because, face it, we don't want to be gluing or bonding together all of our small 3D prints. We really need a machine that can print the full piece at one time. We continue to build larger machines to serve those customers that really want to print big. The Terabot is the evolution of the GB3 Plus, not only in the size, but also in the quality and the features you find on the machine. So as we went larger, we did so to take care of our customers. Our team of additive manufacturing engineers and experts from drafting and designing SolidWorks users, manufacturing, CAD CAM, all the way up to the electrical engineering and the software come together to really produce a high quality machine. The reliability and durability that's designed and built into Terabot really starts at the base. The machine is sitting on four leveling casters that allow it the flexibility to roll around the shop and jack into position for stability. As we scale up the size of our machine, obviously we need to build strength into that frame. The frame of the machine is precision manufactured in-house to tolerances of less than five thousandths of an inch. A robust and solid frame is paramount to having rigidity and repeatability in your 3D printing experience. Of course, every detail is taken into account when we build that core frame of the machine where every screw is torqued to specification. A lot of the time in the build process goes into putting the screws in. I want to say we reduced it down to 85 triangle braces on this printer, and each of those have eight screws in them, so you can do the math. We use socket head screws instead of button head screws because we're able to torque them down more. We use a torque wrench for it instead of just a drill. To ensure that everything is flush and square, we use an L-square and we put it against the rail and we make sure that it's at a perfect 90 degrees. We also use one, two, three blocks to make sure that they're flush with each other. I have my own fixtures to make sure the spacing is correct for the side plates. With it being so big and being one person who builds it, I have to rely on others. When you're printing this large, it's important to have a precision build platform. The bed of Terabot is 36 by 36 inches, half inch thick aluminum plate that's been precision blanchard ground to within three to five thousandths of an inch. The bed is heated by a full size silicone rubber heating pad, which allows the printing of those high temperature industrial materials. The thermal compensation has been taken into account with a nine point bed leveling system to get that pristine surface and those really great first layers. The bed surface is then topped off with the print and Z, which allows great adhesion for many, many thermoplastics. That precision print surface is supported by aluminum extrusion that's again machined to precision of less than five thousandths of an inch and guided by true linear rails that are high quality and maintenance free for the life of the machine. Terabot is really a step up in size, which means that we need to boost the power to our control system and our moving axes. The GB3 Plus offers the NEMA 17 motors, which are a great complement for its size, and the NEMA 23 high torque motors for the Terabot offer all the power and reliability with that closed loop control system, which offers that additional benefit of always knowing your position during the print process. Now GB3 Plus is a great machine, but the open loop control can allow some times where you don't actually know the position of the print head, which is different than the closed loop control. The flexibility that we built into Terabot really extends to the print head that's designed and developed by Re3D. The hot ends are interchangeable. So we use the high flow Mondo hot ends, a standard 0.4 millimeter nozzle size, which allow us to build very large parts very quickly but you have the option to go smaller to a 0.25 nozzle or larger to a 0.8 nozzle. And you can achieve those full speed 60 millimeters per second print even with the largest nozzle. The flexibility of Terabot extends to the open material architecture of the machine, allows us to put those spools of filament on the backside, PLAs, the ABS, the nylons, the polycarbonates, the flexible materials feed directly into the hot ends. So it's a direct drive mechanism 
powered by NEMA 17 motors with our research and design feed gears, pushing that filament into our own design of hot ends. With any industrial machine, you have to pay attention to every detail, and no detail is overlooked. The electrical system has flexible cables that allow over a million cycles of flexing. All of the wires are protected in the flexible cable carrier system. Those wires that don't move are encased in our Panduit wire routing for a very clean look and a very safe machine. The Terabot electrical enclosure is a 14 gauge solid steel enclosure, which is the same as the GB3 Plus. But here it's 20 inches square because we needed to make room for all those closed loop drivers, the higher 500 watt power supply, the larger gauge wires, and everything is still routed neat and clean in our Panduit system. Right next to that electrical enclosure on Terabot is your user interface and the main power disconnect. Everything is conveniently located close to each other. The user interface allows you to have full control over the machine, preheating, changing filament, moving the axes around. Terabot's control architecture is based on the open source Marlin firmware, which is the same as the GB3+, which means you still have access to those great features like ditto printing. Dual extrusion also means that you can print two different materials at the same time in the same print, and it can be the full size of the bed. So 36 by 36 inch dual extrusion capability. It can be the water soluble support material, the breakaway support material, or perhaps you want two different colors in the same part. We offer flexible software and your choice of softwares for controlling the machine as well. Simplify 3D is one of the best slicer programs available on the market for taking your model and turning it into your finished product. It allows you all of the material choices, all of the control over the machine. So if you wanna speed things up, slow them down, use a new and unique material, that software gives you the flexibility to do that. Industrial 3D printers at this scale mean that you're going to be using industrial materials. Terabot uses the standard 2.85 millimeter thermoplastics that can extrude up to 320 degrees Celsius. Terabot really benefits from having that full enclosure. It allows the temperature to get up to 60 degrees Celsius, allowing you to do nylons, polycarbonate, ABS, and other engineering grade materials. We've got access panels all over the machine. So the magnetic latches allow you to take the panel off, get access if you need it, and then snap it right back into place. You also have two LED lights that help illuminate inside of the machine so you can really see what's going on. Even a beautifully engineered machine such as Terabot is not enough by itself. It's really backed by the full customer support of Re3D. You have lifetime customer support for as long as you own the machine. You can get extended warranties up to three years and SLA as well. Our education training and support can be on-site or remote and we offer a path to upgrade. So as the technology changes, you can bolt on the latest and greatest. As you look at other large format industrial 3D printers on the market, I think you'll immediately see for such a low price point, the build volume and the quality that's built into these machines is unmatched. This offers those capabilities for industry, for art, design, architecture, even education to build big at a price point that is affordable. Re3D's goal of printing huge at an affordable price point, allowing people to have access to the technology, means that you can have a fleet of printers on your factory floor. Just like Gigabot, we built Terabot for those who like to dream big and print huge.